Hi guys, um, welcome to my channel. Um, I'm going to review this um, Sonic uh, hold all. It's for beach fishing. Um, and the reason why I bought this, uh, I bought this because there's no zips on it. Because uh, I found that having zips on hold holes, you know, you can get salt um, inside there and the salt can. Um, can basically corrode away the zips. I found even the plastic zips as well. You know, if you get a bit of sea water on there or a bit of sea spray, um, the sea the sea spray will evaporate, leaving the salt behind, and that can also damage your zips as well. So the reason why I bought this hold all is uh, it actually doesn't have any zips at all. So it's actually perfect for what what I what I want it for. So this is the hold all itself. It's actually quite short. Um, um, I don't know what length it is. I can get the specifications and I can put them in the description. Uh, but the hold all itself, um, I've actually got uh, one, two, two beach casters, and that is like um, a carp spod rod that I use. Uh, it's actually great. I, I love using that on the beach. Uh, and obviously, I've got a seven foot um, tripod there. And the tripod. Start with the tripod first. So the tripod, actually, I'm gonna put this down on the floor so it's easier to get into the video. So the tripod fits in there. A buckle that comes around to grip it, so it's more stable. Going further up, same thing up here as well. So then buckles actually grab the whole rods goes all the way around so you can tighten that up to have a nice firm grip uh, this here is just on the outside and that just grips the whole doll itself um, so yeah that's how pretty much that's what it's like the whole doll so that's the tripod what I'll now do is I'll open these buckles up And then I will just move over to the inner section. Let's see. So over here, you've got two sections. Yeah, this section here, where I have my beach casters. These are uh, 15 foot 9 inch, I believe. Uh, pen surf blasters. Uh, they're in obviously three sections and what I tend to do is I put rod grips on them just makes it easier um, So they're in there and the other section over here is just spare So I've just like I said, I've got this spod rod uh, Inside here, which I use you know sometimes, you know if I want to do a bit of float fishing or um, If I want to fish in just close by like a little scratching rod uh, Or even if I want to chuck out a five ounce lead, you know that that will pretty much do it. Um, I actually do like that rod. I can easily get 100 yards with that, no problem at all. Even with a five ounce lead, no dramas. So this is, yeah, this is pretty much it. Um, I like it because like I said, there's no zips, nothing to corrode, nothing to go wrong. It's sweet, simple and efficient at doing its job. Uh, these buckles obviously go all the way back and yeah, obviously you can, Bit difficult doing it with one hand when you're holding your camera, uh, and then you can just close that up there. There we go. So, yeah, that's closed, that's closed, and just quickly do this as well. That's closed as well, and all you do is you can just tighten this up by pulling this. There we go. That is now tight. So the whole doll itself, it's got this long one to put over your shoulder, or you can carry it from here. 
I found carrying it from here is balanced quite well, as you can see. You can also put this on your back as well. And to be fair, if you chuck this over your shoulder, I found that the balance is not great. Um, but yeah, it's there anyway. You know, you can always chuck it on your shoulder and just fiddle around with it until you get the balance right. But yeah, I mean, that's a Sonic holder. I will put the description of this um, uh, rod holder um, in the... I will put the description in the in the comments below. Thank you for watching.